we need an office. It's like a first class seat on like Emirates Airline. Um, this is where I'm working for the next three days. Oh my god, I swear my hair is nice. It is Monday morning and we, oops, sorry. We are doing week two of my vlog. So this is like a little Sada shell tucked into a Sada. It's not a skirt actually, it's squirts. I don't know if that's even what you call them, but see, there's it's like short, so it's really Convenient. And then a little Sada blazer. Oh my gosh, I was not kidding. And these are actually Sada shoes, believe it or not. I have to do a lot of things today, actually. I have a couple of meetings I need to go to. I have to um, go downtown and look at two new office spaces because I, want an, I need an office. For the past couple of years, I've been working just from my home office, which has been fantastic. But now I'm to a point where I need I love structure and so I need the like the structure and discipline of going downtown to an office like it sounds like a drag but I'm really actually excited about it today's Monday and believe it or not I love Mondays I really do I see Mondays I kind of wake up first thing Monday morning and I am just like so excited to start the day because I just see it as kind of like it's a fresh opportunity a fresh start to do amazing things so I really love Mondays. I love the beginning of the week. And plus, oh, this is also, if you saw my last vlog, um, you would know that today is actually day six of post-surgery. So everything is going fantastically. Look at, I'm actually extending my arm for like the first time. So yeah, we're gonna just cruise around and we'll see what we get into. We are on our way out of here and we are headed downtown. Today we decided we need an office. <laughs> so we're going to shared office spaces. Yeah, so <laughs> since it's basically the end of the year and I have like a thousand trips planned between now and New Year's or the 15th of January, I figure it's not, it doesn't make any sense to actually rent a proper office. So what I'm gonna do is check out this option of shared off shared office spaces. The shared office space makes a lot of sense in this day and age with so many people really working independently, working from home. Whether or not yeah. you work from home for somebody else, another company, or yourself, getting out and getting that motivation and having inspiration exactly. from others in a so it, not in a energy. social no, not but a like social an environment. Energy, I get in, energy from being like around in, people. Right, it's the and same inspired. concept as going to cafes. Yeah, but actually having more of an office environment, which is super cool. Trying to do what we're doing from like a home office with my two kids, it's just like it's not cutting it. I just don't feel like I can be as I'm committed 100% into work or 100% into mom. Yeah, exactly. It's always a partially in work, partially in mom mode. Yeah, no, totally. And and so I don't feel like I'm I'm like accomplishing at the rate in which I would like to be accomplishing things for this due project. And so I just think it's the best thing. To be honest with you, I was telling John the other night I completely miss office life. So we have a winner. We have Yay. a home. Regis, here, get the sign up there. Yay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Here. New office. Yay. Starting tomorrow. So excited. Move it in. Move into the neighborhood. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go see um, the terrace. Yeah. This is the new office. This is happening. This view is amazing. View. Our business has a home. Thank you for coming with me and playing with me all day. High five. High five. Successful day one. Super successful day one. Got an, got an office, office space. Hi.
Okay, so it is Tuesday morning and I am driving downtown. It's just 10 a.m. and I'm a bit later um, than I had kind of hoped I'd be getting with the program today. But it's not bad, at least it's 10. I don't have a driver today to pick up my kids from school at 12.15, so I'm not gonna be able to really make this a productive work day, unfortunately, at the office. Um, but I am gonna go in right now, I'm gonna sign the contracts, get everything all squared away, and um, since everything, since these offices are like turnkey ready, with furniture and everything and internet, like you can start the day you pay and sign your contract. Yeah, I'm glad I'm saying this because I also have a, I have a doctor's appointment. I have my one week post-op doctor's appointment today at 4.30. So we need to go to that. Yeah, I tried a new ponytail today. I'm gonna do this tutorial really soon for you guys. I'm gonna do this tutorial really soon for you all. It looks really good. I've worked from home for the last couple of years which has been fantastic. Well, you know, I've been on like 110% full-time stay-at-home mom mode. I mean, I've been working, but like, you know, mom. Beautiful Mr. Carman. Um, his mom mode has been my priority for sure, which has been amazing. But now that the kids are bigger and they're both in school every day, you know, this is, I feel like this is the next chapter. I'm really excited about it. I'm just getting to my office. <laughs> it's my mini office. Just, it's like, it's like a first class seat on like Emirates Airline. Um, this is where I'm working for the next three days because my contract technically starts the 1st of November so my office isn't ready yet so I'm in this like I guess you call it a shared workspace so here <laughs> this little, that's it. it's just this little table they give me a phone and a place to sit Well, this has been an amazing first day at the office, the new office. Love the space, the energy, it's the coolest location. I'll give you a little tour of the past, so. So this has been my little area. My office will be ready next week. You can see, it's my window. And that's my view. So I just got to my plastic surgeon's office <laughs> for my one week post-op I guess doctor's appointment and I just gave me my little card that's all my my implant information on it that's what we did that's it 375 cc's. Okay. All right, so I'll just hang out and wait for the doctor. Good morning. You say Good hi. morning. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. It's monsoon raining. It is monsoon raining out today. It's like zero visibility out there. Seriously. This is actually Magaluz's first day in technically the in the office. So exciting. Seriously. You can't see any buildings downtown. We're on no. Avenida Balboa, and we're getting the water like water is right there right now. Yeah, the ocean is out there somewhere. So, anyway, we go to some pop up music. business. We are on our way actually to the Bristol, the Bristol Hotel where I lived at last week with, with my sister Magaliz 
Uh, we have an event we're going to. Our dear friend George it has this, um, it's a, an inauguration for a new super luxury real estate project. And right now we are gonna have a date night around the corner at our favorite restaurant, La Posta. So here's a little bit. I'm like so parked so close. I'm in the bushes. Shut that door. Okay. Oh, I meant to. Oops. I meant to close my mirrors. Probably would have been a why. Okay. So let's head in. So pleased with that. It's actually going across the street. It is 5.52 in the afternoon now. I've been here all day long. Okay, so it's gonna be really interesting to see what the status is of my car that I just left parked like in the street. I hope I don't have like a big parking violation sticker on my window. I hope it's not been towed. And I hope it's not been hit. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we are out of the office, walking back to the car. Oh my god, I swear my hair is not here. Holy shit. Oh my god, my car has been towed. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, my car has been towed.
Oh my god, it's been towed. Or stolen. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god. I don't even know what to do. Oh my god. Crap. My car's been towed. Holy crap. Dude, there's no... Well, it is a yellow zone. Oh my god. Ah, oh, John's gonna freaking kill me. Okay, I, dude, I left it right there. Oh my god. Okay, I gotta make a phone call. I figure this out. Where's my car? Holy crap, I cannot freaking believe this. Oh my god. So, yeah, my really slick and brilliant idea this morning to not valet my car and pay the 25 or 24 25 dollars a day in parking resulted in getting my car towed. It's been towed. My car was towed today. I have no freaking idea what I'm supposed to do. I mean, I just called my secretary, my, and so she's figuring it out, but Sucks. So now look at that's the rush hour traffic. So I just requested an Uber, which is like also virtually impossible at this hour because everyone has all the Ubers. And so, wow, was that ever a learning experience? Good morning, it is Friday, yay. And today, let's see, I'm not going to the office today. I'm actually just about to meditate. I meditate every single day, right when I wake up. And that's when my hair is all crazy right now. I still have makeup on from last night. I never seem to get my makeup washed off as well as I should, but. So yeah, I woke up like this. Magalis and I are getting ready for the Chanel event we have this morning at 9.30. It's like 9.10. Always running so late. Pure perfection because I'm not crazy about the shirt I'm wearing but since I'm wearing the hideous bra post-surgical bra I kind of I'm very limited as to what shirts I can wear right now but at least the fact that I doubled up on the white tank tops I think it helped so I am wearing the white tank tops two white tank tops they're identical just little cotton ones and this jacket actually is from uh, is actually a Sada jacket. Everything, I always wear Sada. I wear like so much Sada. The jeans are, these are Hudson jeans. And they're like high-waisted and skinny. And they're dark wash. And then um, the shoes are Sada, I just said. And then, okay, so the pin is a Chanel pin I got a couple of years ago. And then my pearls, um, my watch, that's all I'm wearing. And then, I'm gonna carry this Chanel bag today, and that's it. And hair courtesy of Megalis. So, okay, I think we're ready to we're ready to do this. Can I do my outfit? Oh, I haven't looked at that invitation. And this might be a restaurant. <laughs> I've never been here before. There's like no cars Meg, here. There is. It says restaurant. Hold on, I need to check the reservation because I don't think I'm up right. There. Can we walk through? No, I don't want to because I think it might seriously be like a cafe and not a boutique with a Chanel event. <laughs> Here, let's figure this out. I have to turn this off for a second and check my invitation, which is on my phone. Getting back into the car because yes, I'm at the wrong place. I um, I don't know what this place is, <laughs> but it's not 
a Chanel. Um, it's, it's not what we're looking for. I think it's a restaurant. <laughs> we went to a restaurant instead of a Chanel sneak preview. I don't know where we're supposed to go. Okay, so go back out and go to the right. Walking in, found the place. Brown, just like the shoes. So this is what we're gonna get. We're gonna order the shoes. 